tonight, October 23rd's school board meeting, Raisinville School will be presented a new American flag from VFW Post 1138. Mr. Hopper and the flag corps consisting of Hunter Frazier and Keaton Walters will be pre present to receive the flag. Trunk or Treat will be at Raisinville Thursday on October 25th from 6.30 to 7.30. If you're interested in getting more Halloween candy, the Monroe Ravensville Trick or Treating Time are both 6.30 and 8 p.m. on Halloween. And speaking of candy, Sam has an update on some of the breaking news in the Milky Way. Does Mars really have candy bars? Well then, scientists haven't found candy bars on Mars yet, but they might be closer than you think. A recent study suggests that there may be enough salt water near the surface of Mars to produce, produce the O2 needed for oxygen breathing life forms to survive. Candy bars may, may not exist there in time for Halloween, but who knows? Maybe we'll be trick or treating on Mars in the future. Ben and Erica, back to you. Thanks, Sam. I'll keep my feet on the earth for now, though. Just a reminder that Ned Yo-Yos are still on sale at lunch and will be until the end of lunch tomorrow, Wednesday 24th. Haven Netto has an update on the sports world for us. Yesterday, Raisinville's flag football league continued with the Bobcats defeating the Cougars 34-18. The Cougars had a few big plays toward the end of the game, but... The Bobcats passing game and passing defense was in full effect, giving them the victory. Back to you. Thanks, Haven. Let's take it to Brady and Owen with the weather. Today's forecast is partly cloudy with a high of 53, low with 33, and winds approaching 14 miles per hour. We can also expect some clouds. Weather in the low 50s and possibly rain later on in the week. Back to you. Thanks, Brady and Owen, but unfortunately, that's all the time we have for today. So from Erica and myself, good morning, good evening, and good night.